breaking news, insightful analysis, news that matters, delivered with precision and clarity. Welcome to our YouTube channel. Stay informed, stay ahead. If you are just joining us, you are welcome to our YouTube channel. Kindly click on the subscribe button to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, do not forget to click on the notification button to be the first person to get an update when we upload our news. And now to the news of today, the headline. The president stood up throughout his October 1 broadcast. His predecessors sat Sam Omashaye. I don't even need to read the menus to understand what this person is trying to say. So because the president stood to to read his broadcast, that is an achievement to Mr. Sam Mashaye. Really? Is that what we are celebrating now? Our oh, what an achievement. Our president stood all through to read his broadcast. Really? It is well. And now to the main news. One of the chief things of the All Progressive Congress, APC, Sam Omashaye, has compared how President Bola Ahmed Tinubu delivered his Independence Day speech with that of his predecessors. He made the statement in a post that he shared on his official X handle on Wednesday. In the post that he made on his page, he said, President Bola Ahmed Tinubu stood up throughout the national broadcast that he made on Independence Day, October 1. But few are willing to observe that. To observe that. <laughs> what is there to observe? What is so big? What's the big deal in him standing to read this broadcast? What is he supposed to do? So, okay, Buhari sat down to read the Independence Day. And so, so is that an achievement? Is that what we are talking about? Now, uh, Sam Omashai said his predecessors sat when they made theirs. He said if President Bola Hamed Tinubu had faltered, it would have made headlines. The APC chief then said the president gave an upstanding delivery. Indeed. Here is what he wrote on his official X handle. The president stood up throughout his October 1 broadcast. Few are willing to observe this. His predecessor sat. If he faltered, it would have made headlines an upstanding delivery. The things we celebrate in this country, the things we we applaud, it's so appalling. Like, okay, the president stood up to announce to do this broadcast, so we should be happy that the president has done something really good. It is well. In the comment section, somebody says, This is obviously the first achievement of Tinubu led APC government since the inception. Their president stood up for a few minutes. Abby, this is an achievement. That's the only thing they can pinpoint that, okay, yes, this is what our president has done. He stood up for a whole 10, 20 minutes to read his broadcast. It's an achievement for them. It is well. Somebody has also said, what is the meaning of all this? What has standing or sitting that got to do with governance? Abby, will that bring, will he standing to read his broadcast, really bring down the price of petrol? Will it bring down the prices of food that has skyrocketed? What are they celebrating? What is this man celebrating? I don't understand. Taiwa has answered, if he likes making it down, of what point was the whole bala blue? No work, no money, no food. Yes, there are more pressing issues that they should talk about in the country. How to reduce the cost of living in the country. The full price first. Food. Those are things that they should be talking about, but they are talking about the, the president sat, stood up to read his broadcast. Meaning, meaningless things that they are talking about. Adekunle Davis said, President was tired of sitting, so he decided to stand, which happens to be during his live broadcast. So, Mr. Man, say something else. What an achievement. Somebody else is saying, These guys are so shameless. Yes. So, so shameless, so mediocre, saying things that are irrelevant to the progress of the country. Is he standing up going to change the price of oil? Is it going to change the light, of, light tariff? How much you are paying for lights now? Food, transportation, everything is expensive. They are not talking about that. Bad road. 
kidnapping, corruption, everything is going wrong in the country and this is what this man thinks he should talk about. Very annoying set of people in power. I don't understand them. Somebody else says that broadcast was recorded. If after reading a few paragraphs, it sat down, who would have known? Abim? Because it wasn't live. He was reading it, they would have done cut and join, cut and join. He would stand up for a few minutes and sit down, stand up for a few minutes and sit down. I don't even understand what these people are taking us for. So we should be jubilating. Another person said, at times, one wonders how Omasha is reasoned. He is always trying to be in the news, but for the wrong reasons. Another person says, you did look for appointment. Maybe, maybe that's what he's looking for. He's trying to... to to, to rob the president's ego so that he will say, ah, this one likes me. Let me put him in one position there for me. Because I really don't understand why you would not see something else to talk about except for the fact that today is October, what, and you're saying saying your president stood up for, 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 for some minutes to read, read, to read the broadcast. These people learn. Eh? And that person says, so Tinubu did not give this man an appointment, even after all his vituperation against Mr. Peter B, LP, and the Gibbos. That's why he's trying to rub his ego now, so that uh, Mr. President will remember him and say, oh, this man, I've not given him something. Let me give him something now that he has said something good about me. It is well. Somebody else said, so we should clap for him because he stand and deliver nonsense. Is he supposed to lie down? Help me ask him, oh, is he supposed to lie down? How is he supposed to, 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 to address us in the first place? Is he not supposed to stand? I don't know. Somebody else says, please ignore him. He doesn't know what he's saying exactly. He should be ignored because some people, they just want to be in the news. Now, everybody just wants to keep saying something. Now that Instagram, I've been on YouTube, everything is been, Everybody just wants to trend and trend for the wrong reason, just to have likes just to have views just say rubbish just uh let me just type rubbish people will start commenting they'll fall for it and stuff like that it is well somebody said what befell him before because he was overdosed that be <laughs> you're a stupid psychopath and that person said a useless bootlicker that has nothing of substance